Hey, it's Todd Alton. These are Walsh's words. Today's word is shark repellent. Not we go swimming and put something in the water. That's trying to prevent someone from trying to take over your company. Now, shark repellent is generally put into place before someone comes to try to take over your company. An example of this is you can have bylaws or certain restrictions on your public company that kind of prevent or a suitor, someone who's trying to take over you, an LBO or a biot artist, try to prevent them from doing it because they find these little shark repellents in the water of your company, they're already deployed and make it more expensive or more difficult for them to take you over. Now an example in the 80s is that TWA was bought out by Carl Icahn, but they unfortunately were lazy, didn't pay attention, didn't have the shark repellents in place, and Carl Icahn was able to take control of the company by simply buying it in the open market. There's provisions today in Delaware and Nevada and other states that can prevent someone going over 15% or 20% without board approval or make it very difficult to take companies over. Today's word is shark repellent. Hey, thanks for watching Wall Street Words. New words and terms delivered every single day. Please subscribe, push the bell. If you found this information helpful or you think someone could benefit from this information, please share this video. Thanks for watching our channel. Always good things happening here.